Platonic plurals, Chicho. How does the current monetary world system changes impact our societies and us as consumers, uh, families, workers? Um, Dave, in the in United States anyway, forty percent of the money supply that they created was created in the last two years, right? So that the money um, monetary policy, right? Uh, the creation of money has uh, introduced inflation of the yin yang in our societies germany is at 20 percent right europe is well above 10 percent united states is saying is at eight and a half percent but it's above 10 percent everyone knows that in canada they're saying it's around six and a half seven percent or something like this but it's way above that as we all know right so the monetary system they've basically our western economies were on the verge of collapse they've been on the verge of collapse multiple times and band-aid deals have been made right they collapsed in 2000 tech saved it in large part so did the war in afghanistan and iraq because our economies are war-based economies right in 2008 collapse obama came in started three four more wars serious wars man by the way okay libya syria yemen more in iraq more in afghanistan they did some shit in Sudan. Uh, Yugoslavia kicked in. I uh, know Yugoslavia, sorry, Ukraine kicked in. Ukraine, by the way, the shit show that we're seeing right now be, was started with Obama. Okay, please appreciate this, right? So all of this chaos was created to feed the economy even more. Now we're on the verge of collapse again, and we need more wars. Unfortunately, we reached the level when we need global war to save this shit show of centralized crony capitalistic uh economy uh and it's not an economy it's an oligarchist technocracy right so that's how it's playing out and the world economic forum the globalists right the neocons know this right so that's why they're saying they need to build back better because it's collapsed and it's collapsing right and the way it's collapsing is their wealth in large part is collapsing so the, what they're trying to do is convince us that whatever it is that they're doing they're doing it for us right just imagine bill gates Carl Schwab, uh, uh, biden uh, obama the technocrats in silicon valley the those uh globalists in in the eu saying that they're doing all of this right collapsing our economies waging war with russia starting world war three killing the supply chain bring introducing famine into the world that's going to hit us in the next year two three years right Cr doing all this for us because we need to build back better because our carbon footprint is too high you who who, who still believes that shit? really who who in their right mind believes that 